going on everybody see here welcome back to some more icarus beta weekend four and today you know i was i was gonna spend i was gonna spend an episode getting like prepared and ready to go but i think we're just gonna go after i think we're gonna go hit up the i'm trying to decide i think we're gonna go hit up this uh satellite right here today in this episode and i think the only thing that i really want to take with me i want to take some food obviously is i want to get a canteen i really want to get a canteen going so i think that's going to be our goal and we're, we're gonna hope for the best because we were over prepared for the first one so hopefully maybe we'll be prepared enough for this one i don't know we'll see but uh yes thank you so much for coming out hopefully you're all having a fantastic day make sure you leave a like on the video subscribe if you haven't already let's get into it so we need the tech tree and we need tier three canteen okay so Two leather, eight steel ingots. We don't have any steel anywhere. Um, and I don't have any steel here to make. You know what? Actually, I think I have an iron node right outside the door. Um, oh, I also have a little bit of an iron node right here. There's a little bit. And then we got this guy right here. So we're going to make some iron. We're going to make some steel. We're going to get a canteen going because that's going to be super helpful in keeping our uh, H2Os up. And then we're also going to... Uh, since we're going to a frozen area, I think we're also going to go ahead and bring the stuff that we need for like a campfire and maybe we should bring a bed as well. That might be who of us. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. Um, oh gosh, my stamina is so bad right now because of the pneumonia. So let's see. Uh, I just got 50 iron steel bloom max what's that gonna oh my gosh it's gonna give me eight exactly no way oh that is perfect okay and then my inventory we've got 87 rifle rounds i think we'll be good on that and we got a bunch of bows let's go ahead oh let's also repair our stuff um let's go ahead and get some repairs going and then should we go ahead and make a better knife you know what i'm not going to because this one we could repair while we're like out on the road whereas the other ones i wouldn't be able to Okay, so that's good. Let's go ahead and get some oxygen. Uh, let's see. Food situation. How's the food? Food situation looks okay. So we'll go ahead and bring that into here. And then what do we need for... Let's actually just get the stuff to make a campfire. Just so we already have it in our inventory and we're good to go. Um, I think we need what? Uh, stone, sticks. And didn't we need fiber? Oh, I know we need leather for the steel things. Uh, but what do we need for... What am I out of? Fiber. I'm literally out of fiber. Do we have fiber anywhere? Rope? No fibers? You gotta be kidding me! Alright, let's take this eight steel bloom. Let's get that in the furnace. And then let's go grab some fiber. Activate that bad boy. Oh, you know what? Hold on. Let's pull out the titanium, the copper, and the platinum. And uh, let's get just that going. Alright. Let's go grab some fiber. And let's make this happen. Second satellite. I can feel it. I can feel it in my bones. <sighs> I need to take this thing out. This thing is in, in the way all the time. Okay, so there's our campfire. Let's go ahead and craft one of those. Have it in our queue, ready to go. Uh, you know, an oxidizer might also be a good thing to have as well. Leather and bone. Okay, let's make that too. Just so we can set these down. You know, grab a little bit of oxygen and a little bit of food because we're going to be out in the arctic and my last arctic trip there was a ton of wolves so we had pretty much like infinite food and uh infinite food supplies there's that let's see what else we need uh we needed bone and what else do we need leather easy enough okay oxidizer let's go and craft that that's in our inventory ready to go is the eight steel done eight steel is done good to go now we can go ahead and throw our copper back in there our titanium our platinum and then where is the canteen made is it made in oh yes perfect canteen at the ready and then let's see i think if i I'm trying to remember how the canteen works do i actually have to like use the canteen or can i like Press to drink from this. Um, press to fill container. Hey, there we go. Okay. All right. What time is it? It is 10 o'clock in the morning. And we are heading 
basically straight south okay i think i think we're good to go i'm, I'm like I'm, I'm hesitant to go um you know what actually hold on crafting we probably should make we should probably make a few suture kits let's go ahead and make like five of those we'll go ahead and make five like basic bandages as well oh we never made a bedroll we should make a bedroll as well Okay, I think we're good. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna leave the leather, the bones, leather, bones. We'll go ahead and take some sticks. We'll take some stone. I probably don't need 80 fur with me. That's probably a little, uh, little overkill. There's our oxidizer and some bandages. Okay. All right, we are doing this. We're rolling out. Let's make it happen. Hopefully we can make this work without, you know, going too crazy. Now, I think we just head south. I'm pretty sure, like, we just kind of go around into the Arctic area and <laughs> hope for the best. Oh, look, at there's our dropship. Oh, it's like we're back where we all started. <laughs> you know, I'm going to grab some oxide on the way there, too. Just so we have some oxide to use in our oxidizer once we place it down. Oh, is that... Is that our first snow spotting right there? Is there snow right there? Or is that just, like... Not loaded it. No, I think that's snow. I think we are in the snowy area. We're about to be. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, we are. We have officially arrived. Okay. <laughs> oh, the snowy area. Now, I am going to keep an eye out for caves because I don't know if there's any caves in this area. Oh man, could you imagine if there was like an avalanche or something right now? That'd be awful. Also, everything looks super like... It almost looks black and white through here. I wonder, does it think I have like HDR or something on? Okay, so here's the wolf issue that we're going to have again. Because this is what we had last time. There's just so many wolves in the Arctic area. Like, look at... One, two, three, four, five, six... Maybe it's just because we can see him now. I don't know. Either way, I try to use the bow if I can. I'm actually kind of curious too. Like, if uh, oh, when I so when I select the uh, the satellite, what's gonna come running? Is it gonna be like a bunch of wolves, or are we gonna have like a polar bear issue or something? I am going the right way, right? Yep. Okay. Looks like we're about halfway there. <laughs> oh, there's rabbits everywhere here now, too. Wolves, rabbits. Okay, let's keep going. I'm not trying to... I don't want to fight you guys if I don't have to. Okay, we got to be getting close. We should be able to see it soon. It's like, I mean, we can see way off in the... Di Is it under... Maybe it's in that area? Oop. Okay, we got our first polar bear. That's gonna be exciting. Um, let's see. Polar bears are, I think, three headshots with a rifle. Uh, oh, we gotta go right through there, and I don't think there's any way we're gonna get through here without fighting this guy. All right, we have 87 rounds, so we should be okay. Holy moly. Oh, and there's the wolf. Are we good? All right, let's grab this polar bear skin. Because, I mean, why not? Oh, you know what? I didn't bring a good enough knife to actually get the thing. <laughs> Darn it. Oh my gosh, another polar bear. Are you kidding me? Where's this thing at? Oh, is that, is it like, is that it right up in there? Uh, I don't want to fight you, polar bear. I really don't. You just leave me alone, and I'll leave you alone. Oh, oh. We have a mutual understanding. You know what? It's mutually assured destruction. Well, no, I would win. I think the polar bear knows that I would win, too, and that's why. Where is... This... Oh! I think it's it right there. Oh, yeah. Totally it. 
Okay, we gotta be careful. There's lots of cracks. Oh my gosh. That looks like a cave right there. Just saying. It, it totally looks like a cave. Okay. Oh god. Oh. Oh my gosh, it scares me every single time. All right, <laughs> Here, here's satellite numero dos. Um, okay, we're gonna hit the button and we're gonna go stand out in the middle so we can see like what's going on. All right, it's armed. Okay, it's arming. Maybe stand back just in case. Okay. Whatever that satellite's doing, the wildlife really don't like it. Group 15 will be interested to hear about this. Okay, where's... Wilds coming your way. Where? Polar bear? Where? I don't see anything yet. And I'm worried. I don't see anything. Oh, you know what? I bet you I had to be within the area. It says one minute. Do I have to go hit the button again? Oh, here we go. Where are you? Let's give me another Jaguar. I don't see it though. Oh, don't do this. Don't don't jump scare me. It's going to be like a tremor or a graboid or something. Oh, it resets when you leave the area. No way. We just need to find it. Where are you? Where are you at, kitty kitty? I don't. I'm terrified right now. My anxiety is through the roof. I mean All right. You're good. Okay. Warheads ready when you are. Don't hear that every day. Where I am not convinced. I am in a false sense of security right now. Okay. Number 2. Oh my gosh. These things were designed to be deployed in orbit. You crack that at ground level. And it'd eat everything from here to the horizon. So, don't. Okay. You know, that wasn't that... I mean, that wasn't that bad. I feel like there was a Jaguar encounter that I missed. I think I hit the button and ran. And I think it stopped a spawn from happening. Or maybe it was supposed to be like a polar bear or something. I don't know, but... I mean, I guess I'm not that worried about it. Oh, wonderful. Minor winds approaching. You know what? I actually am kind of curious if there is a cave right over here. That looks like a cave. Let's go check it out. We also have a giant hole here. What's in said hole? Hmm, just a hole. Are you a super spooky cave? Oh yeah, it's even already open. Oh, this is going to be terrible. Please nothing be alive in here. Doesn't look like it. Looks like it's just a big open cave. A little bit of light here. Nice. Okay, so, all right, so there's some gold. There's some more coal. Um, it looks like we could, I mean, we could possibly come back here. Lots of coal, actually. Wow, lots of coal. So yeah, we could actually come back here. Uh, we're not like, we're not, ter well, my base is like right there. We're not terribly far away, but you don't want to bet you there's some caves closer by. So we're going to wait this storm out. And we're going to head back. And then I guess we're going to prepare for the final one. That one was too. Was that too easy? Was that? 
I feel like that one was fairly easy. You know, I almost wonder if I'm supposed to get polar bear stuff while I'm down here. You know what I mean? Like, maybe I'm supposed to go down here first to get uh, the polar bear armor. Actually, that's tier two, isn't it? Strong, lightweight body armor with extreme protection against cold. Warm and moderately protective. Heavy. Oh, well, this is lightweight, though, but it's good against cold. Hmm. See, that makes me think that maybe... Maybe we're supposed to get polar bear here. I don't know. You know, let's go ahead and take a drink. Hmm, delicious. Oh, now we're like super cold. <laughs> Darn it. Don't drink during an Arctic storm. I should have known better. You know, I think we're just going to set up camp here. I think we're just going to set up camp because uh, might as well. Let's go ahead and let's grab our bed. Let's grab our campfire. We'll set that down, set that down, and then let's go ahead and light up a little bit of a campfire here. There. Now we don't even need this, and we're nice and toasty. And then we can actually... We could set our spawn point here, but I think we're just going to sleep because it's already... It's getting late, and I don't really don't want to traverse the rest of the way back in the dark. Oh god, there's a polar bear right outside. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh, I'm so glad that they don't come in here. You know what I just realized? This was actually the third satellite on the list. Which makes me kind of wonder if like that was was that supposed to be the the, the difficult one? Hmm. I don't think so cuz like this one is super far away. Well, I mean, I guess it's actually not that much further than what we just did now. All right, it is morning time. We're going to make our way out. We're going to go do our things. Um, it is a little dark, but... Oh, no, it's actually not too bad. All right. Homeward it is. Oh, uh, you know what? I think we're going to have a wolf issue here. Mm, I think this one already... Nope. Trying to, uh, like I say, I'm try, trying not to fight all of these if I don't have to. Even though I got, I do have to say, um, last time I was getting like a crazy amount of XP for killing these things. So I guess this could be a little bit of an XP farm. You know what? I'm going to see. I'm going to see how much XP we get off of this. We got... 1852 oh my gosh that's like a ton hmm <laughs> that's that's a pretty good xp farm holy moly you know if we had a little cave over here somewhere that we could throw up like a skinning rack and just go hunting like this is like a super amazing xp farm like fur bone hide xp like you got it all here Oh, I didn't get the sneak. I didn't, I didn't get, ooh, 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 hello. You probably do a lot of damage, don't you? Okay, are you dead? Oh, I got a laceration. I got a cut. Are we good? I don't see any more wolves. Uh, let's go ahead and use our bandage. All right, good. No more cut now. Oh, delicious berries. Let's get that berry bonus. Heck yes. I'm all about those berry bonuses. Oh, no. Storm, really? I wonder if we can hide in our shuttle. Uh, let's see if we can find a cave and hide out the storm. You know, sometimes this... Wait. I don't actually see a storm thing popping up in the corner. Maybe we're not actually going to get a storm. Maybe it was a false alert. Oh, shuttle. You are a sight for sore eyes. It's so good to see you. It's going to be even better when we have our third vial. Actually, you know what? Let's see if we can go ahead and drop this one off here since we're already here. 
I hope we can. Ooh, what if it doesn't save it though? Press to interact. Um, ship cargo. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, don't ever do that. Don't, don't ever do that. Oh. I was like, oh no, it's gone forever. Cause like things fall through the map all the time. That's like a, like, a, it's like, it's 70, 30 split that it's going to fall through the map. Holy moly. I thought, oh geez. Okay. We're fine. Everything's fine. We're fine. Let's head back with our, our bio weapon and <laughs> put it in safe spots and Oh, geez, never do that again. You know, it feels good to be back home. This cave is the best cave. The most welcoming of the caves. Geez, Louise, let's get that fixed. Get it fixed while we have the stamina, I guess, right? Oh, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. So, uh, we'll drop this guy right there look at that all nice and safe get a nice spot right here open for the next one. Oh, well we came we saw we did and i would say with how that one went i say we're good enough to go for the next one now oh geez that next one because like the other one was right here that next one is about twice as far away and we have to like make it all we have to get all the way there and come all the way back to get to our space shuttle or launch pod or whatever it is. So that might be a journey in and of itself, but I think we're good. I think we're ready to go. Um, how much more ammos do we have? 82. I think we might go ahead and make some more. Um, now nah, we probably don't need any more hunting rifle rounds, do we? No, probably not. So uh, yeah, next episode, last satellite. Let's do it. I think it's going to be amazing. But yes, that's going to end this one. So have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so much for coming out. Uh, like, subscribe, all the fun things. And next episode, the final, the third, the last satellite of the weekend. <laughs> Thank you so much. Have a good one. I'll see you next time.